Hi all, JV here from Info Hut, and as a repairer, I always get the most probably common question after something has been fixed is, how can I check the health of my battery? Or do you have any type of testing equipment that can check if my battery is okay? So as I said, it's a very common problem. I'm gonna show you now how you can check the battery health and explain what the readings say. It's a menu in your iPhone that you can go have a look and uh, I'll give you an example now and we'll see what we can find. So as I said before, it's a menu within the actual iPhone settings. So what we need to do is go to our home screen on our iPhone. We go to settings and then from settings, we obviously make sure at the top here and then we scroll down till we find battery and then we go to battery where we will find battery health. Now you click on battery health and once we're in there, you'll see that it has a maximum capacity and a peak performance capability. Uh, and it'll say, uh, have a little section at the bottom for optimized battery charging. Now, we look at the maximum capacity. Okay, maximum capacity. This is a measure of the battery capacity compared to when it was new. So this phone is saying it's at 92% and from what Apple says on the website, a normal battery is designed to retain up to 80% of its original capacity at 500 complete charge cycles. The, the one year warranty includes service coverage for a defective battery. If it's out of warranty, obviously Apple or a third party repairer can service it for a charge. So what we're looking at is anything above 80% should be good. Now, this is where I'm gonna kind of go against Apple. I do find that anything under about 91%, uh, I just feel that my phone for myself is just not at the level of being uh, comfortable for me to use. So the battery drains quick. It's still very stable. All the apps work fine, but it's just not uh, as good as it used to be. So once I see it go down towards these low 90s, I replace it myself. Uh, that's just my personal opinion. I do find that a lot of customers do start complaining even at about that 91 to 90% range where they do want to change the battery. So I hope this helps, but there is another type of thing that certain people can actually get different types of warning messages where it doesn't even say a percentage. You can have a message saying uh, the iPhone is unable to determine the battery health and Apple authorized service provider can service the battery. So it might give you an unknown type of reading. So generally, if you do have any type of other uh, warning message where it is not saying any type of percentage, there is a good chance that your iPhone probably does need a technician to actually have a look at it. Uh, but I'll tell you one thing, most of the time when that message does come up, it's a safe bet to say something will need to be replaced. So uh, I hope this helps. Once again, like and subscribe, and I'll be bringing more videos to you. Thanks, bye.